Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. If you are brand new here, my name is Haley. And I'm Tommy. And together we're Magically Mickey and more. So today we have a video that we're super duper excited about. Yeah, we've been really, uh, really excited, really uh, anxious to get this one. A little bit nervous maybe? About one of them, I'm definitely nervous. Yeah, I'm definitely nervous. So on our latest trip to Disney World, we picked up some snacks yes. from the Japan Pavilion at Epcot as well as the China Pavilion. Yes, we got one from the China Pavilion as well. Yes. So we are going to show you those snacks and then we are going to try them so that you don't have to. Yeah. Or so that you'll know or, you should pick yeah, them up. Yeah, to let you know that it's a must buy. Yeah, so we're going to show you all of the snacks that we have first. I will save the yes. uh, one that's making me a little bit nervous for, for last. last. Yeah. Um, so if you do like all of this snack trying <laughs> nonsense that we're going to do today, make sure that you hit that like button and that you consider hitting subscribe. We're going to have a lot of vlogs coming out about yeah. our trip. Um, we were there for about eight days in the park, so we do have a lot of footage from the park. So Seven park days, yeah. So we have a lot of uh, footage coming coming your way, so stick around. Hit yeah. that subscribe. So without further ado, so the first snack that we have is made by Lay's. Yes. But it is not... A flavor that you can get anywhere in the US. So this is the one we found in the China Pavilion. It is salty egg and shrimp flavored potato chips. The bag was just too cute, I couldn't say no. Yeah, the little guy was staring at us and we're like, all right, we gotta bring this one home. Yeah, so these ones were $5.25, which doesn't seem too bad. So we're gonna start savory and then go sweet. Sure, But yeah. then we'll save the yes. crazy one for the yes. end. Yes, yes, the finale. So we've opened them in true chip fashion. Yes, it's There's mostly like a air. quarter, yeah. quarter <laughs> of it, which was actually probably pretty nice for the plane ride. But I just think they smell like like potato chips. They just smell like regular potato chips. Yeah, I'm excited to see um, if the flavor is really strong because it does not smell um, too shrimpy or anything. No. Like that. I don't even know what egg flavor would be like. So they're really thick. This is a very thick potato chip. And they have like, yeah. So say. there's the chip. It's got really like exaggerated ruffles, Ridges, like waves, yeah. yeah. All right, ready? It's okay. It's sweet. It is sweet. I think the shrimp flavor is like a really sweet, sort of almost sugary flavor. Yeah. It's not my favorite. It's not the worst thing I've ever had. No, it's fine. It's one of those things where if you put like a bowl in front of me, I would just keep eating it like, I probably wouldn't until it was done, but but it's not bad. Like yeah, he'll eat them in the house. I probably will not. I wouldn't seek it out, but it's like totally fine. It's nothing special. I don't love it. I don't like that it's sweet. No. But all right. Well, what would you rate it out of ten? Like a five. Yeah, I'd probably go like a three and a half. I don't dislike it, but I don't. It's just nothing. Yeah, I'm not crazy about it. So for that one, I definitely think the packaging was cuter than the chip was good. Yeah, the packaging definitely um, wrote a check that the chips couldn't cash. If they had a plushie that looked like that, I would buy it. Yeah, it's just a cute little egg, but those chips will get eaten. I'm not crazy about them. Yeah. All right, next one. Yeah. All right, so the next one. Also has a very cute picture on Yes, it. so I'll show you the picture first. It's got like a little gorilla. There you go. It's got a little gorilla munching on some cheese doodles. So yeah, my understanding is that these are just cheese like Cheese flavored chips, I think. Yeah, I think they're just like so the Cheetos, pictures, but just like actually cheese flavored. Yeah, the picture on the top, it's like probably better here. Um, it's like a potato, there we go. There's like brie and it looks like a couple other kinds of cheese. Yeah, like wheels of it's cheese. It's four cheese, oh, duh. Mozzarella, cheddar, gouda, and cam camberet. Camembert. Camembert, duh. Camberet. Camberet. <laughs> like a tangere. Yeah. But they sound good. Yeah. If they taste like those types of cheeses, I'm going to be into it. For sure. They smell cheesy. They look like, yeah, they look like crunchy Cheetos. They smell super cheesy. They do. They just look like... Cheetos, but they're not as like neon orange. They're just like a normal orange. Yeah, they're like yellowy. So let's see. There we go. So just it's pretty standard Cheeto shape. There we go. Cheers. Sweet. 
Also sweet. I like that one though. I like it way better than the first chip. Yeah, it's actually pretty cheesy. It's not like overwhelmingly cheesy. It doesn't taste like um, yeah. the cheese powder that you get like with Kraft Mac and cheese and stuff it, like that, that I feel like a lot of cheese snacks can. It's good. It's definitely it's definitely sweet though. Like it's 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 on it has, the sweeter side it has of savory. A sweetness to it, yeah. But I think it's good. Me too. I like that one. To stay consistent, we will rate that one out of ten as yeah. well. I would probably give it a seven. I'm gonna go seven as well. It was good, and I will eat them. Yeah. But I don't know that I would buy them again. Good, not great. All right, so we are on to our sweet. This is the one I think I'm most excited for. Yeah, it's matcha milk candy, which sounds delicious. We yeah. love matcha in this house. I really like the packaging, how it has the cows in the field on there. I just think it's really pleasant to look at. All right. We had to resist eating these the entire time because yeah, on the plane. we wanted to send them oof, back. It smells weird, yeah. It smells bad. But they're All individually right. wrapped, so I don't like I don't know why it would smell weird because they're individually wrapped hard candies like that. And then when you open it up, it's just a very, very green hard candy. I'm exposing myself. Can y'all see my hot Cheeto fingers? <laughs> I ate hot Cheetos earlier while we were watching football. Big time exposed. Oops. But yeah, it's just like a green hard candy. It's it way like a, greener than I thought it was gonna be. I it's thought like it was a dark, gonna be. It looks like a dark green butterscotch. Like. I thought it was gonna be mixed with white. Yeah, me too. Mmm. Did you crunch yours? No. It tastes like green tea. Yeah, that's really good. I like that a lot. If you like like matcha tea, mm -hmm. and it's not super duper sweet, so it's not even like a green tea latte. No, it's just like, yeah. It tastes like you matcha. made green tea with a little bit of sweetener. It's in good. It. Mm -hmm. I like that one a lot. Me too. Those are gonna go really quick. Mm -hmm. Time to rate it. Yep, since we started rating it, we gotta keep rating them. I'm giving that a 10. I'm giving that one, oh, a 10. Yeah, I would eat that hard candy over almost every hard candy that I've ever had. Yeah, I'm gonna give it a nine. Can't give it a 10 because that's, it would need to be like the best thing I've ever had in my life, but it's really, really good. I really, really Well, on really like a candy it. scale, I would give it a 10. Oh, I, I just don't like candy that much, and so this like really does it for me. Yeah, I have no problem with your rating. Yeah. All right, the next one I'm really looking forward to. Yes, yes. I love lychee. So it's another hard candy. And it's a lychee hard candy. So these ones are also individually wrapped, which is really nice. Yeah. Uh, yeah, they're all individually wrapped, which is like to be expected. I think I see that a lot with sort of like Asian hard candies and stuff like that. Yeah, which it makes sense because only in America are you expected to eat an entire bag of sweets in one <laughs> sitting so they don't individually wrap it. So I don't know if you can see inside, but they're just little clear candies and I'll show it again when Let's they're see. out of the wrapper. Yeah, but they're like translucent. Yes. All right, I'm really excited for this. We got bubble tea at the mall yesterday and I got lychee jelly in mine. This is not looking very pink. No, it's not, it's it's a, it not. was the wrapper, you're right. Yeah, it is not. So it is just a little, let's see if you can get that. It's very hard, it's struggling. <laughs> but yeah, it's just a little clear round candy. It looks a lot like the matcha one, mm -hmm. but this one is just sort of clear and opaque. There you go. That's a good word. Mm. Maybe I shouldn't have given the other one a 10. Yeah. I might have to adjust my That's scale. why you can't give stuff a 10. Yeah, before we, at least before we've tried all of them. Mm, 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 mm. This is so good. It's so good. Yeah. It tastes like just like this. So I was just telling a friend the other day when I was younger, I used to have these. This girl, Karen. Karen, if you're out there, let me know where I can get them. What's up, Karen? Hello. Thank you for exposing me to lychee. So she had these jellos that she would bring, uh, but they were like an Asian jello, and so they were super little. And the container almost was shaped like a thimble. And then they just had a plastic clear lid. They also and, look like the Nespresso pods. Yes, it's exactly I know it's what they look niche, like. But they look like Nespresso pods. But in the inside, they had a lychee like chunk of lychee in this lychee jello and I've been obsessed with them since the third grade. Yeah, I'm not into lychee jellies. I don't really like the texture. Mm. So these are good. This is a good alternative. Still gets you that like sweet, a little bit like tangy almost. It's so good. It Guys, good. it's so good. It's really good. I didn't finish my whole green tea one because I wanted to just move the, the video along, but yeah. I'm finishing it, this yeah. one. Mm. 
This one's gonna have to get a 10. So that one gets a 10. Mosh is going down to like 9.3. 9.3, okay. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna give this one an 8.5. I don't like, like it as good better. as the matcha one, yeah. But it is really good. It's better than I expected because I'm usually not crazy about lychee. Mm -mm -mm. It's so good. All right. Whoa, these ones are low in calories. Six pieces, only 100 calories. That's not bad for a candy. So this is a like mango, mango right? gummy candy. It looks delicious. Again, I think they're individually wrapped on the inside. Yeah, I would assume they are. It says gluten-free, delicious, and juicy gummy. Yum. Mm. Delicious and juicy? I'm into that. Mm. Um, this brand seems to have made a lot of the, whoops. This brand seems to have made a lot of the things that we bought, the candies that we bought from the Japan Got Pavilion. It. I'm not even gonna try and say the name. Yeah. And all of the candies, so these three candies, the Gorilla, Cheetos, and our last thing, we all, all got from, from, Japan. from Japan, and it was roughly like $22 or something yeah. like that. I was really surprised, because we ended up getting five or six things from there. And it was only um, 20 bucks. It's yeah, the cheapest I, things we've ever bought at I Disney. I expected it to be like 38, just because it's like, it's Disney. Um, nope. But no, only $20. So if you want some cool snacks, they're cheap. Okay, so they are individually wrapped. Yep. It looks like this. Ignore my hot Cheeto finger. Thank you very much. Um, so that's what it looks it's got like. got a little mango on the front. It does. Mango gummy candy. Yeah. And then when you get inside of it. Yeah, typically you would expect it to be shaped like a mango. No. But that's... no frills here, it's just a little disc. All right. Cheers. Mm. I like that one. It's fine. I like the gummy consistency. I feel like gummies like come in like a whole different range of chewiness. This it's one bites right through. Yeah. When you bite it through your teeth, it goes directly through. Yeah. I like that one. The flavor's only okay for me. Oh, I think it's good mango flavor. It's not like crazy sweet, crazy, crazy mango-y. I think it's pretty good for a mango candy. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine? It's Out of fine. 10, what are you giving it? Um, seven and a half. Cause it's good. Yeah. It's just not great for me. I think, I don't know if I like it more than the lychee. So I'm just gonna give it an eight and a half and call it a tie. Oh, so you tied with lychee. Yeah, good candies though, really good candies. Yeah, I was no, I'm super excited. Be sort of lukewarm on at least one of them, but all three are really, really good. And I was expecting to like the savory snacks more than I like the sweet snacks, and that was not the case. No, really good sweets, yeah. All right. Are you guys ready? Oh, I'm so nervous. Are you ready? I think everyone probably thinks we're being ridiculous. Like it's just no, like some people they either know exactly yeah. what we got <laughs> yeah. or they think we're being ridiculous. Yeah, we're gonna eat like a wasabi chip and we're just being babies. <laughs> yep, those are crabs. <laughs> Little crabs. Little crabs. Look at them all in there. It's kind of sad. <laughs> <laughs> but you just eat the whole thing. You just you pop, pop it, it in, in there. Yeah. Hopefully they're like really dehydrated and just kind of crispy, but yeah. I'm definitely nervous. I'm not really like nervous about eating stuff ever, Ooh. but this one I'm not feeling too They're little about. pincers on there. <laughs> yeah, they got their claws still. Oh my god. They goodness. got eyeballs still. They do? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> <laughs> so, this is gonna be something. It smells bad. It smells like fish food. I don't know what oh, I was that expecting. That smells terrible. Oh, oh. <laughs> it really does Whoa. smell like fish flakes. Oh um, my, I don't it know smells, what I was. It smells really bad. I don't know if I was expecting like crab cake smell. I don't know I what I was expecting. Not I think expecting I was expecting just like salty. Pet food. It smells bad. Guys, can we take it back? Mm-mm, 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 they have eyeballs? Yeah, they do have eyeballs, oh, so I picked no. <laughs> I picked one. Uh, let's see, you can get a good look at it. <laughs> so I picked one, it's got a claw on there. There's its little face. You saw his eyes? Yeah, this one you can really there. see his eyes, hold this one. There. there <gasps> <laughs> look at the eyeballs! Staring at you guys. Oh no. I'm gonna take the tiniest one I can find. Aww. Alright. Mm -hmm. I got a big one. 
<laughs> I'm not excited. I'm so not I'm excited. I'm definitely not excited. You heard what? They taste sweet? That's what Amber said. They don't smell sweet. They smell they bad. They smell really fishy. They smell awful. I hate, and I'm like so sensitive to fishy smells and yeah. tastes. Okay. This one's for you, YouTube. Yeah. Do it for Do YouTube. Do it for the tube. Cheers. Mm. It's not good. It's definitely not good. <laughs> oh no, oh no. It tastes like fish food. It tastes like you were supposed to pinch the fish food into your childhood fish tank and instead you went and licked all your fingers. Mm -mm. It is crabby. It's really sweet. Mm -mm. It, it tastes like, um, what am I thinking? It almost tastes like it has like a candy coating. Like it's coated by like a like a clear candy coating, something like that. It's not good. It's like they thought that the it's sweet would save the rest of it. No. It doesn't. It's really crappy. It tastes it's like, like a crab. negative five. Yeah, it's bad. It's, it's like really bad. It's not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Oh. But it's like it's like a two. Lychee, come save me, please. Ooh. Yeah, that was not good. Mm -mm. Those are probably going mm -mm. in the trash. No, we're gonna get other people to taste them. Okay. That was bad. It was not good. It wasn't good. It was an experience. We did it. Yeah. But it tastes like, at, at first I put it in my mouth and I was like, oh, this is one of those things that tastes so much better than it smells. And then you keep chewing and it's like fish food, fish food. That's all <laughs> it tastes like. I yeah. almost wish it was just the fish food and didn't have the sweet because the sweet is just like, oh, I don't know. I, I was not mm -hmm. a fan. Not a fan. Not good. But we found some delicious snacks. Yeah. We tried some snacks so you don't have to. We ate a baby crab, yeah. We did. Oh, that's so sad. I don't even know. They're probably not babies. Those are probably just small crabs. They are definitely yeah. just a, a yeah. type of small crab. Yeah. But we did it. That was a little little snack adventure. Maybe next time we go back to the parks, which I'm hoping is kind of soon. Um, maybe next time we go back to the parks, we'll go to another pavilion and buy a couple more snacks. Yeah. And so every time we go to the parks, we'll we'll kind of dive into one of the snacks of the pavilion. There's so much stuff in Japan too, like that store, I can't remember the name of it, is, yeah. is packed full of them. We sort of just picking stuff that we really thought looked good. Um, so we'll definitely, yeah, we'll definitely have to Let us know and... down below if you would like to see us trying more things, either from the parks or just different foods and things like that. Yeah, and if you have any snack recommendations. Let us know. And if you've ever tried these snacks, if you were brave enough to try these little crabs, little crabs. at the J Japan Pavilion in Epcot, let us know down below. Definitely. And as always, guys, thank you so much for watching. We really enjoy hanging out with you. Yeah, thanks for hanging out with us, y'all. See ya. Bye.